so a pole just came out in that ass. Which is worse, alcohol, pot, tobacco, or sugar. <laughs> it's an interesting mix. More people listed sugar as being the worst than listed pot. The reason I'm doing this video is because I am a expert in health, nutrition, diet, specifically in my circles we promote high carb diets and I've been eating a high carb diet my whole life, 45 years and do not have any problems. It's very likely that I'm doing so much better than the average 45 year old because I have never used drugs one of the few people and my face shows it I have eaten plenty of sugar and continue to eat massive amounts of whole unrefined sugar known as fruit and grains sugar has become a big issue and it also gets into the news. For the average person, what kind of negative things come to mind with sugar? Why do people think it is bad? The first thought is that it's bad for your teeth. Why would it be bad for the teeth? Well, I'm, I'm guessing people would say acid wears out your teeth, which is true. It has that effect, uh, but uh, sugar is not acidic. That's a big myth. It is a neutral. I attract people on the internet who say all these things, these myths. And I also have been asking them recently, just in the last few weeks, I've been saying, what is, name one thing that sugar does to the body that's bad, that usually ends the debate. They don't come back. People have been taught that it's bad, and I bought into it also when I was young, for decades. And now I'm wondering, well, what's the problem? Sugar is actually a nutrient. <laughs> it's found in every single plant on the planet. Nature doesn't make a mistake like that. Our bodies run on sugar. Story. Americans consider sugar more harmful to health than marijuana. When Americans were asked which four substances is most harmful, 49% said tobacco, which is probably correct. Then a much smaller number said alcohol. Then we get to the low numbers who said sugar. And even lower, marijuana. Now we should keep in mind these low numbers represent the kooks. And I'm suspicious of why this poll was done. You know, why poll? Well, well, it's just interesting. But then it gets out into the media and people hear about how sugar ranked higher than marijuana and that's the thing that makes the news very suspicious because this fits in with a whole bunch of anti-carb propaganda that i hear in my circles and this propaganda seems to be working these conspirators which may be the same people conducting this poll so they can get it out into the media. They're hoping the public will equate sugar with any carbohydrates. And they're not just hoping. There's a whole bunch of books out there which are convincing people to link these things. Using my vast knowledge of nutrition, and especially carbohydrates, 
I can only think of one problem with refined sugar. Since the sugar is removed from all the other nutrients that work with it, your body will have to take those nutrients from the other foods you eat and from your body. And that's what's called an anti-nutrient. But for this to cause a deficiency, you'd have to eat a really bad diet with a lot of sugar and not much nutritious whole food. Pot, on the other hand, causes a whole bunch of problems. Not that I'm anti-pot, but uh, it alters your brain's function. It's a drug. And, and everybody knows that, like with cigarettes, the sm just the smoke in your lungs will cause cancer and emphysema. And it doesn't really matter what smoke it is. I just did a search, and I found a website that has a huge list of supposed problems with sugar. The website is called marijuana.com. <laughs> Hundred and forty six supposed problems with sugar. And a lot of these it says can cause this and can cause this. And all that is extrapolation from other problems it supposedly causes based on research which is faulty and <laughs> and on and on. So it's a bunch of crap. After the first post here on this form. The first response <laughs> is, wow, this is a pothead saying, I think I need to cut back on my sugar intake after looking at this. Key, key word there, <laughs> besides the irony, <laughs> the key there is after looking at this, after seeing all those lies, Power of suggestion. It works. And the American public doesn't know much of anything. They know more myths than facts. And to be fair, there's a post way down below where the person disagrees with all this list. <laughs> so my advice. Eat your fruits and vegetables. Get your nutrients in. Keep the carbs high and your lungs clear of smoke and then maybe you can exercise and then the benefits keep on flowing infinitely. Mm -hmm.